Hi guys, it's Emily. Today we're going to be doing t-shirt painting. Here's what you'll need for this craft. In your kit you'll find a t-shirt and cardboard, paint and paint brushes, and you'll also find stickers and tape. You can also use scissors and a ruler, but they won't be in your kit. Here are some pictures of other designs that people have done. If you need a little bit of inspiration or a jumping off point, there's lots of ideas here. Okay, let's get started. Now, you can see that there is paint showing through on this t-shirt. Um, it's because I'm actually painting the backside of the t-shirt. Um, the first time I did it, I realized you do need that cardboard in between to help the paint from seeping all the way through. So I'm doing the back of the t-shirt that I already did. And the important thing is when you're taping to make sure you press down all the tape so that there's no gaps because if you do leave gaps then the paint will seep through. So I'm using a combination of tape and stickers here just to show you the different ways to do it but obviously you can just use stickers or just use tape, it's completely up to you. But just make sure you press everything down really snug so that there are no bubbles. And don't forget to put the cardboard in between uh, or else you'll get the paint going all the way through the t-shirt to the other side and even on the other side of the table. <laughs> Time to paint! So you can use the sponge brushes that are included in your kit and I just dabbed it so that I wouldn't disturb the tape but you just want to make sure you go right to the edges if you're looking for those really clean lines. So just take care to get the paint right in between the letters or if there's a hole um, you just want to get the paint right into the edges there. Just squish it all in there uh, or you can see right underneath the flipper uh, of that turtle. You might actually want to use a smaller paintbrush if you have one at home. I ended up using too much paint when I was trying to squish it all in there and it kind of bled underneath the adhesive of the stickers but it's up to you. If you're really careful I'm sure that you'd be able to get a nice uh, sharp edge there. Okay, 
so now we're finished painting. Now we have to let the paint dry and then it'll be time to peel. Just make sure you let the paint dry all the way or else it'll definitely smudge and run along if you're uh, trying to peel off the tape and the stickers before the paint is fully dry. And we're done. I think it looks pretty good. Thanks for watching and I can't wait to see you in the library in your t-shirts that you've painted.